Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a speed flip through of my custom tarot deck, the Queen's Tarot. Um, I'm also going to be posting another video that is a lot longer, so if you just want like a quick peek of um, all the cards in my deck, this is going to be it. Uh, and the other one, I'm going to be talking about like some of the explanations of the cards, um, what my favorite ones are, some of the errors that I have to fix. Uh, I am going to be selling this at some point on Etsy. I still have to make the page. Um, but when I do have a link, I will put it in the description. Um, might not be for another day or so. Um, so if you're confused as to who all these people are on the, the cards, uh, I'm going to be making a guidebook. Well, quote-unquote guidebook. Um, it would just be like a little printout that I would include with the cards because I don't know how to make a guidebook and then make it kind of cheap at the same time. Um, but I'm going to explain a little bit of the world. Uh, there's going to be character descriptions and then each of the cards is going to have a description, uh, the card meaning, and especially for the major arcana, uh, there's going to be like shorter um, character descriptions so you don't have to like flip back <laughs> to read the long character descriptions. Um, so yeah. This is the speed run. I'm also going to include the <laughs> Toad Tarot from the other video at the end of this one. Um, it's going to be the same exact thing. Um, just because it's hard to get <laughs> toads to cooperate. God, I'm making like a whole mess over here. <laughs> uh, last time when I tried to pick up all the cards, they all fell in different directions and... <laughs> It's already happening again, but yeah, so um, there are some errors on the cards that I have to go back and fix. I talk about it in the other video. Um, small stuff, mostly. One of them being uh, the crowns in the corners of these few cards. That was supposed to be just kind of like my signature for Instagram, but it snuck onto <laughs> this version of the deck, which is easy fix, so... There's a little snail in the corner from Adventure Time. <laughs> that was in the uh, original card, so I knew I just had to add <laughs> the Adventure Time snail. Um, and then the extra card, the Toad of Tarot, which I also need to fix because the Major Arcana cards have the, so it needs to be the Toad of Tarot, but that's the extra card because I had two extra cards. It was the same price to print 78 cards as 80 cards, so I did it. Um, so now, enjoy some Toad Tarot. Welcome to Toad Tarot time. Uh, I didn't feel like shuffling the deck because I still have more I kind of want to do with it. Um, but the card I pulled was the Toad of Tarot because I just I just love the card so much. Um, and then here is the fella on the card himself, Fred. And then his little friend, Marco. I didn't think they'd actually like sit still this long enough for me to video this. Um, but here they are. Um, so the Toad of Tarot is kind of just like an extra card, um, because I had two extras and I wanted to do something fun. Um, and I kind of already been doing this little <laughs> Toad Tarot time, so I thought it was perfect. Um, actually the cards in his hand, it'll focus, focus, are in the deck. Um, it's the, uh, the Strength card, the Moon, and the... Oh god, what is that? Page of Swords? <laughs> um, because uh, the Strength card has my dog on it, and so does the Page of Swords. Um, the Moon also has my dog on it, but it also has Fred on it, too. Um, so those are, I guess, I, I don't know if they're my favorite cards, but I definitely like them a lot. Um, so I don't really know, <laughs> to be honest, what the Toad of Tarot would mean. Um... It's just kind of a fun thing, so if you wanted to, you could take it out of the deck. I guess I should have the toads in the <laughs> in the thing. Fred kind of hopped away. Um, but let me know what you guys think it would mean. Uh, I just thought it'd be kind of like a good luck thing, um, or just like a just a fun thing. You could take it out of the deck or whatever. But there, oh oh, they're leaving. They're done. <laughs> so I guess I should end this video there. 
So thanks for watching, and if you're interested, I will leave a link to the Etsy shop so you could uh, get this deck. It shouldn't be too, too expensive. Hopefully I'm going to maybe try to call the people and see if I can just pick it up instead of having them send it um, or mail it because it's kind of expensive. It was like $10 for shipping, so I paid like $30 for everything altogether. Um, but yeah, that will be a thing. So, say goodbye, Fred. In his own way, he says goodbye. <laughs> Thanks for watching.